Many people may mistake it for India, but this little island country has its own personality. Stunning Buddhist architecture, beautiful beaches, breathtaking nature and the friendless people. I am Lux Universe and this is Sri Lanka. Hello internet, welcome to Lux Universe. At another day on Sri Lanka. Today we will leave Kande and we will take a train trip to Ella, which is one of the most popular tourist attractions in the whole country. Not only the town of Ella, but also the train trip itself. The views from the windows should be really scenic and if you ever in Sri Lanka and you want to make this road possible, let me give you a short review of what you should be preparing for. Let's go! Traveling around Sri Lanka is kind of cheap, but if you are here in season, which I am, but you know, it's 2022, not important. I think I would be able to get this on the railway station as well, but uh, the general advice is if you are here and you want to travel on the main railway route from Colombo to Kande and then to Ella, you should book several months in advance. And you cannot do this on the Sri Lankan railways. So we have to book an agency. Now, I did and honestly I really am thankful because it was totally without any problem. It was great. I booked it online. I got to their office. I got the real uh, train tickets. I will give you a link in the description below. You can do the same. But what I actually wanted to say is it's a lot more expensive than if you do it yourself. Now, when I look at my ticket here from Colombo to Kandy, first class, it costs 1000 rupees, which is, well, let's say like four dollars, maybe more, four euro, give or take. Uh, I paid 20 euro for that. So it was a lot more expensive, but if you are not in Sri Lanka and you want to get this reservation, there is no other way. So that's a surcharge that you just pay. But come on guys, I don't know where you live, but $20 for a train ticket to get you anywhere, it's not so expensive, so... I mean, you give these people. I mean, you give these people their job, so that's kind of a thing. But anyway, if you are willing to risk it and you want to really do this on the budget, then uh, let me tell you that the train ticket from Colombo to Kende costs one thousand rupees, and the train ticket from Candy to Ella costs 1200 first class if you are willing to travel anything lower it's probably less expensive but you cannot reserve it in advance so I guess this is a fair deal so I arrived a bit earlier there's a train going every hour and I got into a long train and well, obviously I have a reservation for the next one, so now I have to wait for one hour. I don't really come too much early, because usually the trains are really delayed, and this one was, well, let's say 36 minutes late, so I believe mine will be pretty much the same, so keep that in mind. But just don't go too late. It may happen that it's not delayed at all, but coming in early doesn't really make any sense.
this is totally incredible. The best thing about this train is that you can actually like stick your legs or even yourself out of the windows and out of the doors and <laughs> just let it in. It's so beautiful. Guys, this is insane. I actually met this beautiful, amazing local family. There was this 10 years old kid that recited a poem for me in English and then sang some song in Singhalese. Why you gonna wine? things coming now. Brace yourself because this is what's gonna be fun. Guys, this is such a great atmosphere. Right, so we have managed it through a local Sri Lankan karaoke on the train and well it's getting dark the train ride itself is some seven hours so it will get tiresome after some time but as you can see I didn't get bored at all Welcome to Ella. I'm now waiting for the guy that owns the hotel where I'm accommodated or homestay. He should pick me up by the tuk tuk and I will talk to you from my beautiful terrace with the great view <laughs> because that's what I'm gonna get. And that was the Candy Ella train trip. You know, honestly, when I planned this, I had no idea what would happen. And what happened was such a pleasant surprise. I have never felt... Seriously, really. Even in Canada or Georgia, I've never felt so welcome by anyone. Like by these few families in the train car. <sighs> it was so amazing. Really. I think there's a high probability that are not watching this video but if you are thank you very much you made my day and you made me appreciate this country so much more than I ever had so thank you anyway if you enjoyed this video give me a like subscribe to my channel check out my other social media check out the previous and the next videos from Sri Lanka and like cheers and See you soon.